Hey guys, wanted to go over the dirty dozen list and things that I am partially already doing but really wanting to try to get organic um, or if I can't get it organic, at least wash it really, really well when juicing. So according to the intraweb, um, the dirty dozen from 2018 are number one, strawberries, spinach, which I use all the time, nectarines, apples, grapes, peaches, cherries, pears, tomatoes, celery, which I also use all the time, potatoes, sweet bell peppers, which I eat really a lot of, hmm, and hot peppers, um, so, which I'm sure those vary. Of those, what I use almost daily to um, juice with is my spinach and apple and celery. So I have not really looked into organic celery or anything like that, but I do try to make a really good point. My dogs are playing, so you're gonna hear some growling in the background, but I've tried this video three times, so we're just gonna go with it. Shh, me. And um, so I'm really, <laughs> why? She has all day to play. Why does she play now? All the girl's trying to do is take a video over here. Hey, Flo. Hey, hello. Sometimes when I yell at her in German, it works. Sometimes not. Anyways, ignore the growling monster in the background. So um, strawberries, I will say I don't do a very good job of washing. So I'm going to try to get organic strawberries moving forward or wash the crud out of them. Um, and then spinach, we do, um, we actually bought this, it wasn't too expensive, like a big tub of it from Walmart, the organic one from market side, and that wasn't expensive. Um, what I always try to do though, like the cucumbers, when I buy cucumbers, they always have that waxy film on them, so I try to scrub those very good. Because let's be honest, like who can, who can afford organic for everything, right? It's already quite an investment to juice, um, you know, with buying fresh produce, let alone buying everything organic. So if you can, Good for you. I have two horses and four dogs, so I, that's where all my extra funding goes, and a wedding in three weeks, so. Um, but anyways, in the meantime, um, I will try to get my apples and my strawberries and my spinach organic, because those are, um, I can't. At least she's having fun, right? Um, I will try to get those organic so it can at least help, um, you know, and try to, eat more clean and make sure if I can't get it organic that I will wash everything. Um, that that way, you know, since the dogs are consuming the pulp, I'm consuming all the juice, there's really no waste. So I wanna make sure that, you know, my family and my pets are obviously eating and consuming healthy things. So <clears throat> there's the dirty dozen list. I'm sure they'll come out with a new one for 2019, but these are obviously things that use a lot of pesticides and things like that. So I do have a little garden outside um, that is currently growing a ton of habanero peppers, which I will not be juicing unless you want me to breathe fire like a dragon. Um, so I have to cut them with a glove. Even after glove, I have to cut my hot banana pepper with a glove too. We just have peppers growing in the yard. I did plant a bunch of strawberries, but see, Seeing as my cat lays in my strawberry bed all the time, I think that is impeding my growth of strawberries, but to each her own. So anyways, there is my, whoo, she's, she's going. Um, I have another video of bloopers of why Ellie Mae video bombs my photo or my videos all the time. So you can watch those just for giggles if you like animals, but I do. And I like juicing and I think it's dandy. So um, I will catch up with you guys again next weekend, hopefully. And uh, in the meantime, I post on my Instagram always different types of juices and things like that or fun things that I do. Um, I also post a bunch um, of healthy things. So, you know, although I may not be always doing a juice, I will try to post, you know, something healthy that I ate maybe or something like that. So I hope you guys are also on a health journey. And cheers to a great 2019 and lots of healthy, happy options. So um, have a great day and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.